What is up? I'm Wanda Turtle, and it is time to open some celebrations. Yes, we did manage to get some packs, and we're doing some breaks for some of my patrons. We have A, Tyler, and Ty. Uh, so these are all loose packs I managed to pick up from a vendor. And so we got, uh, I guess we'll mix them up a little bit. Uh, Ty does have 10 versus A, and Tyler have five. So five each, and then we'll find the last five over here. <clears throat> So thank you to my patrons, and we're gonna begin with A. Uh, from what I've seen, um, some people, a lot of people have been using scissors to cut these. Uh, we'll probably try, maybe we'll crack some with our hands, but you know, there's only four cards, so it is understandable. Uh, so it seems like it's one card to the front. And yeah, super excited about this set. I feel like even the commons, you know, these cards that, I don't know, I'm excited for like maybe a month from now when all these redundant ones, I don't know, I think they're all just really good. I feel like I want to pick up, like, even this Lugia. Uh, it is, like, a hollow rare, but, um, you know, I'm, Lugia is no one really chasing this, but that card just looks amazing. So, probably pick up a lot of, like, the bulk cards, even. Dialga, and our first hit is just a Yveltal. All right. But, yeah, as always, guys, thanks for watching. And, uh, yeah, best of luck finding some celebrations pretty crazy um this reminds me of like champion's path when everyone was looking for those etbs even though like this is this set is like you know probably like 10 times better than champion's path was but the hype feels very similar all right Ooh, that's a cool looking mew got a mew dialga again yveltal ah just like cosmog and i think the scissors a little bit quicker open up two this time But yeah, official release date is tomorrow, and uh, yeah, I imagine it's gonna be very tough to find products in the wild. So best of luck. And but you know, places like Target, if you can find it, that's gonna be your best shot at finding getting stuff at MSO, MSRP. And yeah, we're getting a lot of this Cosmog Evolution line, and then a Kyogre. Looks like the Aqua art. So no big hits yet. I feel like um, obviously a lot of people are looking for the Zard, but so many cool stuff. Uh, you know, you got the Gold Star, the Prime, although the Prime, uh, I feel like, <clears throat> was it like Donvan is an interesting choice. Here's a homage to the good old Red Cheeks Pikachu. Veltal Xerneas. And then a Ho-Oh, another really cool art. All right, so nothing too crazy for A. We got one more pack for him. And I feel like, you know, all along this uh, 25th anniversary with all these like these starters, it was pretty cool. Uh, but it was a little, you know, not, it was a little underwhelming to be honest. And then they come out with this set and it's just like all these legendaries. So I don't know, just, I feel like this is just a great way to celebrate the anniversary and a Xerneas to wrap up that uh, first break for A. Let me grab one more pack. I don't know, I feel like that was a little underwhelming. See if we can't uh, get a little redemption with this extra pack for A. Ooh, Professor's Research. I feel like there's pulls so many of these. Interesting way to do the artwork. Um, although I kind of wonder, like, is this just the, the same exact image from the full art, uh, just with the border? And then they just kept his arm. All right, so we did get one of these uh, texture cards. And actually, I think the fact that they textured it was a really nice touch. Um, I wonder, I would be in full support of this idea of taking like non full art cards and making them a little bit more special, you know, maybe with this texture and stuff like that. So we did get a clay doll there. Let me grab a sleeve for that. All right, thank you A. Now let's go to Tyler. Tyler, best of luck, grab five packs. But yeah, let me know what you're most excited for. Um, I think I kind of, I'm a huge, you know, base set fan. So I definitely want those base set art starters. Ooh, Groudon, nice. Lugia. As far as, I don't know, the, the Gold Star Umbreon. I think this looks really cool. 
Zacian V. I feel like the Zacian Zamazenta, there's so many printings of it, so this one's a little underwhelmed. Oh wait, it's a different one. Storm Slash, 30 more damage with the second energy. Oh oh. Kyogre to a Yveltal. All right, so so far we got the Clay Doll, but that's basically it. So still looking for our first big hit. It's Sogaleo. Ooh, that restaurant is really cool. <laughs> Look at that. Very right, nice to a Cosmoem. All right, two packs left for Tyler. Yeah, such a cool set. And again, I feel like all the cards are just, hey, there we go. Okay, no, I was completely wrong about the, the full art being the same thing. So very nice, Professor Oak. Groudon, Rushy Ram again, what the? All right, so we're getting a good amount of duplication here. All right, last pack for Tyler. Another Zacian, you look familiar. Cosmoam, Cosmog, Kyogre. All right, one more pack for Tyler. It's kind of a slow start to this very exciting set. All right, come on. Hey, Flying Pikachu, there we go. Yeah, yeah interesting, uh, you know, spin on very cool cards like the uh, Flying Pikachu. Groudon, hey, a Luxray a Level X. Uh, but yeah, I love this. They pay, you know, pay homage to a lot of the unique things. I think there's like a Delta Species, Gold Star, uh, Shiny Magikarp, stuff like that. I feel like this, this Level X one is kind of like the one of the uh, less, less whelming ones. Uh, but very nice pickup there. All right, appreciate you participating in the break, Tyler. And now we're moving to Ty, who picked up a full 10 packs. Do two at a time. Best of luck, here we go. And definitely haven't watched enough videos to get an idea of what the pull rates are. Um, it does, sometimes it feels like you get like a string of, you know, base set starters, even though it seems like the Charizard's aren't still pretty hard to pull. But I saw like one video where like, um, like TCA just pulled like Blastoise after Blastoise, which I would not mind at all. Ho-Oh -oh into Kyogre. I'm really curious in about like a month from now where all the prices will lie, just because everyone's going to be cracking this set. If they can, everyone that can find it will be cracking it. There's Professor Oak. All right, I wonder when it comes to competitive play. What is your choice of Professor's research? I feel like Oak is pretty cool. OG. Ho oh, oh, into, nice. Rockets Zapdos, very cool art. You know, I think uh, one of my, uh, as far as Zapdos arts, this one is definitely one of the better ones. And you know, he just got this like evil look in his eyes. So definitely appropriate for the Rocket Zapdos. So very nice pull. Let's just take a look at the print quality. Uh, definitely some, you know, imperfect centering. But other than that, things are looking good, like no edge wear at least. All right, let's keep getting some of these nice hits, these textured cards. Ooh, Serpent Pikachu, nice. But yeah, it's just very, oh, there's also the Birthday Pikachu. Definitely want one of those. Zekrom into Palkia. This art is just okay for me. Alright. Definitely feel like Scissors is the way to go. Ooh, are we getting all the Pikachus here? The Flying Pikachu V Max. Very funny. I'll yeah, we'll probably grab a sleep for that one. Actually, I'll, I'll sleep up all the, um, you know, all the hits after this. All right, we got a Lunala. First one I've seen of this one. Rushy Ram, like this art, but we're starting to pull a lot. Oh my gosh. I feel like these two guys always go together. Into a Cleffa. Okay, a baby Pokemon from the Neo era. <clears throat> these borders. <laughs> Centering issues, definitely... Um, very noticeable, a little less so on the back, a little, nah, just, just as a nick. Uh, but yeah, there's a very nice textured feel to this. 
Um, so what you could call it, texture bleed, as of like, you know, when they, when they refer to like hollow bleed. Um, but yeah, another nice hit. Shuffle your hand into your deck, then draw seven cards. All right, and we got like four packs remaining. Come on, let's get a base set art. Let's get a gold star. Let's get that gold Mew. All right, there's the Zamazenta. Zekrom again, are we gonna get your buddy? Ah, no, Ho-Oh. Into a Kyogre. All right, three packs remaining. As always, huge shout out to my patrons for supporting me on Patreon and special shout out to Ty A and Tyler for participating in this break. Lugia, hopefully I will get some, you know, made pre-orders at a bunch of different vendors. Hopefully they all go through and we could do some more breaks like this down the line. And again, best of luck if you're gonna be out tomorrow trying to find some product. Rishiram, hey, there they are, there's the the two friends. Ooh, Mega Rayquaza EX. This one, like, I, I love it when you can, like, see the texturing. Um, that's one thing I missed during the XY era. Like, those full arts, the texture is just so prominent. Um, I don't know, as far as, like, Rayquaza arts, you know, I think it was a great idea to include Rayquaza. You want to include the EX era Mega. Um, but, I don't know, this, this art doesn't do a whole lot for me, especially when you have all these other great ones from that era. So I feel like I, I would have personally chosen some different uh, different selections, but either way, this set is just, I don't know, home run, well done, Pokemon. And that's the third kind of like textured hit for Tyler. We got one more pack, here we go. Can we end this with a bang? Oh, we got another Pikachu VMAX. All right, so the hits are coming out kind of late in the opening, but they are coming out. So Xerneas, Lugia, Oh, Team May was Groudon as well. Very. Oh wait. Uh, so the the other one wasn't Aqua, but it had like some of the uh, the trainers in the background. So there we go. Wrapping it up with a Groudon. Uh, this centering actually is pretty good. We'll put this one in a penny sleeve in case you want to have that graded. But yeah, that is our first opening of celebrations. Have to say, it is a lot of fun to open. And uh, to all the patrons, you know, hopefully we can do more openings uh, down the line. I'll keep you in the loop on that, everyone. Yeah, good luck on finding products. I'm Water Turtle. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.